Hey guys, it's me, Draven Edwards, and I'm back again with another review. And it's about that time again. And you, do you really know the character from Extraordinary Engines? And if you do, answer in the comments below. It was made back in 2016. So yeah. And you know he was just from the episode Engine of the Future. And it's going to be on the Thomas and Friends Trackmaster, Hugo and Skiff. Yes. Hugo was just Hugo was from in the it's, he was Hugo was from in, in the Extraordinary Engines DVD and even the season 20 episodes of Engine of the Future and Hugo in the Airship which are very good and Skiff appeared in Soto's Legend of the Lost Treasure and then blown away and even Skiff and the Mermaid so yeah so I got these two for Christmas so yeah First, I'll take a look at Hugo. His front looks really good. Let me just focus a little bit. His face is just very good. And I know his other eyebrow was just been chipped off, so I really had to detail it in Sharpie marker, and it worked very good. So here's his face. And the side are very good. And I really like his name. And it says Hugo. And I really like the sides. And I really like one of the doors of him. And the back, it really has a propeller. And it has this for the coupling. And some of you are thinking, wait, what do you do with the coupling? What did you do with the coupling? Did you just cut it off? Well, yes, I did. It's all because, first off, one, Hugo is a rail zeppelin, and two, he cannot pull cars or coaches or brake vans or even the brake down train or even my push along engines. Sorry, Skiff. So yeah, and that's why I really had to cut his cup coupling off. If I, if but if I really had it my way, I would have cut it right it off. So that way he won't have a coupling. So yeah. It's just a suggestion that Mattel is lazy for having Hugo for a coupling. So yeah. But however, Hugo looks very good. And he still works. And the propeller spins. Because the motor is loud. Almost not really. But you get the idea. So yeah. His propeller spins. Now let's take a look at Skiff. It is blue livery. So... At the front here, you could see his face. It's just normal, like in the Treasure Chase set version. And his side is very good. It says Skiff's Railboat Tours. And then the back is just good. And as well as the other side, I really like the red wheels. And I really like how the flag tail looked. I really like it when it has yellow stripes. So yeah, now let me get the, the, the brown skiff. Alrighty, so I brought the brown white skiff, or brown skiff, and now I'll go ahead and do the comparison. The faces are just mostly the same. And the size, the, the sides, 
are just a little bit different. And the color are different, and the colors on the back is different, but the same thing with the whites. It's different on the other side too, as well as the flags. And even on the tops, the, the blue skiff doesn't even have the button. But in this one, it does. And even if you put this brown skiff on these point switches, it would be difficult. So yeah. And there, it just pops off. And this gift came in the treasure chase set, if you do know. It's made back in 2015. So yeah. Anyway, that was the comparison of between this blue livery skiff to this brown skiff. Anyway, get out of here. Anyway, that was Skiff. And now let's take a look at the car. And this is a green car. At first, I thought the green car is going to be... I, I thought the car is going to be orange, but... I guess that must be a mistake anyway. So, yeah. So, here's the front of the car. And as you can see... I detailed the fa I gave it a paper face, which is good. And the sides are just normal, as usual. And even on the cargo that came with Hugo and Skiff, it looks very amazing. Really had some green stuff, the crates, and one of these barrels. So yeah, that was the car. And here is Hugo and Skiff as a whole. So what are my thoughts on Skiff? It is a very good model. It it's a very good model. And I give it I give both of these two a perfect 10 out of 10. Even though Hugo looks very good like in the Extraordinary Engines DVD or Engine of the Future or Hugo and the Airship. And Skiff looks very good on the Soder Switching of the Lost Treasure. Or even Blown Away, or even Skiff and the Mermaid from Season 20. So yeah. And one of these episodes were made back in Season... It's made back in 2016. So yeah. Anyway, I'll go ahead and give Hugo and Skiff a run without the car because... I cut his coupling, so yeah. Here's Hugo and Skiff's run in 3, 2, 1, go. Why do I have to be behind for this? Because Hugo is a rail zeppelin. He cannot pull cars. Whoops, forgot to get this out of the way. Oh no, Hugo's derailed. Oh my god, now things are going to get sloppy. Wait, 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 wait. Oh yes, I forgot to mention that Skiff cannot fit 
through tunnels. And now I forgot to get me out of the way. Overuse jokes at once. And there was your run of Hugo and Skiff, everyone. So, I hope you enjoy this video. And if you do, please give me a like, comment, and subscribe, and tell me what you think. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Which, it will be Ryan and Jerome. And I really need to swap these wheels.